don't worry this is my PO box information it is not like my personal address so don't you fret more ladies and my lads and my lads in front oh my god there's a hot bug in here what the fuck was that Gasp. hi my salty pecans and welcome back to my channel if you're new here hi my name is Pamela and on today's video we are going to be doing a plant unboxing video but it is going to be kind of a two-parter but not a two-parter the first part I'm going to be dressed in this sort of cheetah print garb and the second part I don't know what I'm gonna be wearing but it's going to be in the future and I'm talking in the present aka past so yeah the first plant has arrived here today from hurts and the second one has not arrived here yet but I can't keep this plant in the box until the other one comes because I don't know when that one's gonna come but this one has come and it's arrived well <laughs> that's what she said <laughs> I am so freaking immature y'all listen you know what it is like it's not about how old you are it's about your mentality and I feel like I'm really immature and I have a very youthful mentality and that's okay it's okay let don't judge me don't judge me who are you to judge me okay don't judge me it's cool it's cool so anyways if you're interested in these these unboxings <laughs> then keep on watching <laughs> So welcome back everyone all right I'm gonna go ahead and just open this up so apparently this plant uh, let me see what date today is April 8th right and this plant has been sitting in my peel box since I believe April 5th I did not know that the plant arrived I completely did not check my email I did not get a notification that the plant was shipped out I did not get a notification that it was delivered until I checked my email today and I realized it was delivered two days ago so I'm a little nervous uh, to say the least because plants just sitting in a dark box for an unknown amount of time is really not cool and I'm nervous but yeah so I found this plant online and I actually did order this from Walmart but it came from the seller itself and I do want to mention that this plant I once owned and I neglected not neglected but I was going through you know like the whole mental issues like you know like self mentally not here not able to care for what I love and this plant died. It was gifted to me by my Planty Boom Monica Plant Witch SFC on Instagram. And so, if you know if you know the plant that she gifted me, then you will definitely know the plant that's in here. So, I decided to re up and get myself this plant because I love it and I wanted another one. And I hope it survived. Yeah, I'm so nervous. Okay. Are we ready? Oh my gosh, it looks... <laughs> they look so good. Emma Gerd. Emma Gerd. <laughs> oh my gosh. So, it is a Hoya. You know I'm a Hoya maniac. A uh, Hoya fiend. A uh, crazy Hoya lady. I love Hoyas. And again, Mani Mon, she did gift this to me uh, last year, and I was a horrible plant mom, and it is no longer with us. But I found this again on this site, and it was on sale, so I decided, hell yeah, hell yeah, girlfriend. So, booyah, this is a Hoya Wayetii. Varigata. Ooh. Ooh, kill him. Ooh, kill him. Ooh. Terio. Ooh, kill him. Ooh, okay, this is cute. 
This is cute. Love it. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, not bad. Not bad. So I only didn't get one. You know, like, how we, we just plant parents. We have no chill. Like, there is no concept of one. There is no such thing as portion control. If you're gonna get one, you might as get like, you might as well get 300. So I decided to get a second Ohoya Way Eye because um, I feel like I would like a little fuller pot. You know what I mean? A little fuller pot and <sighs> two plants is just what your girl needs. Okay, two plants is literally what your girl needs. So I did go ahead and get a second one so this is really pretty this is really cute I'm actually really happy about this So apparently the label says variegated Wayedii Hoya Wayedii tricolor. So cute. So the first one is smaller than the second one, but they're all one, like one vine. And I do plan on combining this into one pot. <laughs> Are these not so freaking cute? This is so cute. I am so happy. I do have the Kentiana variegata, which is the reverse variegated, where it's green on the interior and white on the exterior. Let me go ahead and get that for y'all. So, in my right hand, I'm holding the Hoya Kentiana Lori Lynn. So, as you can see, the white variegation is on the border and the green is on the interior and this is the way at the eye variegata so you see the variegation the white variegation is on the interior and the green bordering right so that is basically how you know the difference between the way at the eye and the kentiana the kentiana is white on the outside and the way at the eye is white on the inside okay so if you're ever like confused oh what's what that is literally how you can tell them apart so like I mentioned I am going to combine both plants into one pot so yep let's see the next beauty that I picked Ooh. hi my salty pecans all right so this is part two of this video the second plant has arrived it is right here and we are going to go ahead and open it up this plant I also got it from Walmart um and yeah pretty much I, it arrived at my P.O. box uh, a few days ago and then like I like the way my P.O. box is set up it's like even if your package arrives today you have to come get it tomorrow it doesn't matter like it doesn't matter so don't worry this is my P.O. box information it is not like my personal address so don't you fret my ladies and my lads and my lads in front. Oh my god, there's a hot bug in here! What the fuck was that? Gasp. Something with legs literally just crawled out of here and flew off. And I'm like, we have to find it before it lays an egg. What the fuck? Gasp. Oh. Okay, so this is how this looks like right now. It comes with the footstool thing. I feel like a table might have been better, but I'm really worried about this fucking Gasp. bug. I'm gonna open the mesh of my window. Y'all, I'm actually tripping a little bit because I know it's not something that is a typical pest but again 
I don't want something that is a bug in my space. Alright, we're gonna... I'm gonna have to figure this out <laughs> off camera, but... Alright, this one comes with a stand, um... Whatever. Pretty cool. Ah, not my foot, please. Not my foot. Alright, this has like a whole bunch of duct tape and padding, so at least I'm really happy about how the plants, you know, arrived, like, undamaged, because it's already in a pot. But the reason I picked this plant out is because mainly... I've, I've, you know, there are like in general, as plant parents, as plant enthusiasts, as plant hobbyists, we would like to, in the best case scenario, you know, have a plant, like one of each plant that you're into. So, I, I've seen this plant. There's different forms of this plant, and I refuse to pay money for overpriced cuttings I refuse to pay money for something that is mass-produced by well-known companies like I, I personally I can't get with the get down you know I can't get with that swindle like again I'm all for you know people making extra little pocket change like whatever when pandemic you know hustle how you gotta hustle but not off of my fucking hard labor gasping and not off of you trying to pose as, you know. No, this is not unfairly priced, you know. So, plant. Hey! Ah! I okay, 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 this is not for you. Go inside, inside. That was my cat trying to go outside the window because I opened the mesh to try and let whatever bug out and then she was just like, ooh, fresh air, let me escape. So, we're back to this. Last intermission, I promise you, I promise you. Ooh. This is one of the Skindapsis Tribu, Tribu Moonlights, the Silver Skindapsis Pictus, and y'all, I'm pretty happy about it. There has been a lot of shifting with the soil, but I would say this is not to the seller's fault. This is more towards the post office's fault. This is in a very peaty mix, so I think I'm going to leave it in this mix but I'm gonna have to do a little bit more research on the soil mix but this is pretty nice y'all so those are the two plants that I did pick up both from Walmart I don't really get the chance to shop at Walmart because living in the city the only other Walmart is in I believe like Long Island which is just like ridiculous journey to get to Walmart so unless I go out of town out of state then I don't really get to enjoy the luxuries of having Walmart plants. So, yay! What do you all think? Are you happy with the two babies that I picked up? Ah, this is so pretty! And this one does come with a stand like I showed you. It comes with the pot. And it also comes with the footed stand. So, yes, we're gonna really love these babies. <laughs> was this worth the wait because I definitely think it arrived really well it's been in the box since I believe for over a week this has been in a box and again it looks really good really good shape so definitely definitely get into it wow so those are all the plants that I actually picked up you know during today's little combo haul I could not wait 
to unbox one plant together I had to do them separately because I don't know when the next one is going to arrive but I hope you all enjoyed this unboxing if you like this video please let me know by giving it a thumbs up and sharing subscribe if you aren't already join this little cookie family because we're pretty awesome here become a salty pecan and don't forget to hit the notification bell to be notified every single time I upload a new video and I'll see you in the next one let's get growing bye